Hi friends, welcome to the channel Unshackling Sudokus and Puzzles. Ashish here and today I will be covering a classic Sudoku on our channel. So this Sudoku is constructed by uh, 3 good 5 u as the name goes uh, on the discord and I really thank the author for giving me an opportunity to cover a video on our channel. So before going to the Sudoku, I would highly recommend you to please subscribe to the channel Unshackling Sudokus and Puzzles if you haven't done so. It will really motivate us to cover videos on a regular basis. And if at all you have a request for any Sudoku variant or a puzzle genre, you can let us know in the comment below and we will surely make a video on it. And now coming back to this Sudoku, so we will start the puzzle here. Classic Sudoku rules apply. You need to place digits from 1 to 9 in each row, each column and 3 into 3 box without repetition. Let's start solving this Sudoku. 9 is in one of these two cells. <coughs> Sorry. Okay, 2 comes in one of these two cells, so 2 comes here, 7 is in one of these two cells, 5 is in one of these two cells, this is a 5 here, 5 is in one of these two cells, and 2 comes here, sorry, Eight comes here. One would be here. One, two, and six. Not a six, one, two, and six. Okay. Three, four, five, nine. Right. So four, five wouldn't be here. Five, nine is not here. Three, nine is not here. Four is not here. Okay. 2, 4, 5, 6 1, 2, 3, 9 So this is 3, 9 2, 3 1, 2 and 9 Come on. Nine is in one of these two cells. One, two, two, three. If I get 1 3 somewhere here I could use an X wing uh, I'm sorry double Y wing here what is this cell then yeah if it is a 1 3 then I could eliminate one from this cell that would be amazing what is a 1 2 3 4 5 6 oh I need to remove 4 and 6 to get that 1 3 here <clears throat> maybe 
वन टू वन सिक्स एंड टू सिक्स नो टू इज ऑलरेडी गॉन यूर ओके दैट इज नॉट पॉसिबल फाइव सिक्स फोर फाइव फोर सिक्स आई नीड फोर सिक्स समवेयर हियर और मे बी इवन हियर इफ आई कैन रिमूव वन थ्री फ्रॉम हियर आई गेट वन ऑफ द वाइविंग्स हियर और इफ आई रिमूव फोर सिक्स फ्रॉम हियर आई गेट वन ऑफ द वाइविंग्स हियर दैट्स अमेजिंग दैट इज एक्चुअली अमेजिंग How do I do that? So either way, I can get one waving if I remove these two or that two. Come on. Is that an exchange here? One, two, two, three. Three, four, four, five, five, six, one, six. That's an exchange here. Amazing. Very uh, good. Uh, you know, intentional solve path here by the author. So what happens here is, if you have such cases, you can surely say that one has to be in one of these two cells, two has to be in one of these two cells, three has to be in one of these two cells. Four has to be in one of these two cells. Five in these two and six in these two. Now, what happens if that's not the case actually? So let us assume you have a one here, or you don't have one in one of these two cells. This would be two. You will, of course, this would be six, right? That gives you a three here, a five here, and both these cells would have to be four. That's a very good exercise here. One, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, one, six. Amazing! Those that removes one from this cell, two from this row, three from. So none of these cells can be three now. Should I mark that? So one. Okay, three is already not here. One, two, three, four, five is not possible. Six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, seven, and eight. Six, seven, eight. Okay. So four would have to be in one of these two cells already done. Five would have to be in one, already done. Six would have to be in one of these two cells. So you remove six from this cell. Amazing. You got a one four. I was either looking for four six or one three to get a Y wing. If I had one three here, one two one three two three. One two two three one three one could have been eliminated from here. If I had four six, four six five six four five five, four could have been eliminated from here. Come on, that's amazing actually. So oh, this is three or a seven. Come on. Oh, so this cannot be six. Can be eliminated from this two cell. Uh, six can be eliminated from here. So six is in one of these two cells. These cells are not six.
8 is in one of these two cells that is not helping us come on i was actually really happy to see if i could have got a y wing here but i am thinking author has kept something else for me here come on i'm getting a call sorry Three nine three seven. One of these two cells would have to be seven or a nine. What happens if you have seven in one of these two cells? That would be amazing. So if you have a seven in one of these two cells, this would be three. This would be nine, right? Seven in one of these two cells and nine here eliminate seven and nine both. From these two cells and both of these cells would have to be a five. That's an extension of five wing. Amazing. So seven cannot be in any of these two cells. Seven would have to be here. Okay. That eliminates seven from these cells. These cells. No. So what are the possibilities in these cells? One. Three. One three six. Oh, that's nice. You have anything with one three six pair triplet? So first I got the exchange here. One two two three three four four five five six one six. That helped me eliminate three and six from this cell that I got. Then I got one four here. That should be something with this one four one four one six. I need a four six to make sure I can use the viving here, but that is not helping us. One two two three one four, three four four five. One two two three three four one four. And again, exchange, but the exchange extends back to the cell. So, what happens if you have a one here? That would be two. That would be three, four, and you won't have anything here. What an amazing logic here! So, one, two, two, three, three, four, one, four. So, these two cells, you always have to look for the first and the last cell. And if they have the mutual uh, mutual digit here, which is one, the cell seeing both of these cells cannot be a one, right? So if one, two, two, three, three, four, and one, four. So this cell cannot be a one. That has to be a six. What an amazing Sudoku this is! What an amazing Sudoku that gives you a five, four, three, two, one, nine, three. Seven. I hope I'm not wrong here. <clears throat> Five, seven, and a nine. That was actually amazing. This is really the beauty of a hand crafted Sudoku. It it was like a chain reaction. The first chain reaction and the second chain reaction that solved this Sudoku easily. So this is five. You have a six eight here. One four seven. Okay. That gives you a five here. It's two four and seven. So that gives you a seven here. Two and four in any order. One sixty eight. Okay. Eight. This is one six. One six and eight. One 
1 3 and 4 4 so this is 1 3 1 3 and 4 this is 9 3 4 1 3 so this is 1 3 6 3 and 6 5 3 6 and 7 right so that gives you a triplet here this cell cannot be a 7 3 6 7 so this is 4 1 and a 7 here that gives you 1 and a 4 here that gives you 3 1 4 2 and a 4 that gives you 2 and an 8 here 3 and 6 right 8 and 9 so this is 8 9 3 6 3 6 so this would have to be a 7 this cell cannot be a 3 or a 6 this is 6 this is 3 I used I didn't use uniqueness I was saying that it wouldn't be a 6 but I still got it logically Eight six eight six two and a four, right? So this is two. That is four. One and a seven. One and a seven. Three and a six. Amazing! What an excellent Sudoku this was. Actually, uh, I think the intended solve path was just the first, uh, you know, X cycle which had a very good chain reaction and this that eliminated a few candidates here and that gave us uh, you know gives us the second chain reaction i don't think that the extended wiping that i used here was required but that was amazing to again uh, look for amazing sudoku thanks a lot uh, uh, thanks a lot to the author for such a wonderful sudoku I really enjoyed solving this sudoku i hope you enjoyed too do like and comment if you want us to solve any other sudoku variant or a puzzle genre and don't forget to subscribe to the channel thank you